in this time and generation, God is still speaking and he speaks through his servant. Will our Lord God do anything without revealing it first to his servant, the prophet? During one of our services on the 6th of September 2020, the man of God gave a prophecy about the western region of Nigeria just as the Spirit of God led him. These were his words. Very soon you will be hearing the Lord is using traditional traditional rulers, like the way he was using Hazel, the way he was using Ahab. They will start catching some big fish that are sponsoring evil in our area. And it will come as a result of traditional rulers, people that don't even know God that are pagans. So you will understand the meaning of I am the God of all flesh. That whether you are Muslim, Christian, I'm your God, or whether you are pagan or whatever. People will be doing some things that will be, I'm not talking of healing, I'm not talking of supernatural things. Papa I'm talking of physical so things. Going into the bush share. and bringing out kidnappers. Papa they don't know, they will think it's their charm, but it's God. He is the God of all flesh. He doesn't have religion. I'm going to see it in 2021. I'm going to see it where? The authenticity of this footage can be viewed from a live broadcast on Facebook during the Sunday Power Service held on 6 September 2020. The section of the prophecy can be viewed from the time period of 4 hours, 47 minutes, 12 seconds. Very soon you will be hearing the Lord is using traditional traditional rulers. The man of God said God will begin to use traditional rulers people who can be categorized as pagans to perform great wonders physically. They will start catching some big fish that are sponsoring evil in our area. What? And it will come as a result of traditional rule of people that don't even know God that are pagan. Chief Sunday Adeyemo, who is popularly known as Sunday Igboho, is a traditional Yoruba activist a native of the Yoruba ethnic group of the southwestern part of Nigeria with the title of Akoni Odua of Yoruba. He is known for his metaphysical abilities which makes him a formidable opponent in battle. He also played a vital role in the Modakeke Ife communal crisis sometimes in the 1990s. The man of God went further to specify the use of these traditional heroes and rulers in search and capture of major kidnappers and tourist cells, as well as prominent political figures who have been sponsoring them. People will be doing some things that will be, I'm not talking of healing, I'm not talking of supernatural things, Papa, I'm talking of physical so things, like going into the bush share. and bringing out kidnappers. They don't know, they will think it's their charm, but it's God. He is the God of all flesh. He doesn't have religion. We are going to see it in 2021. So I came here to come and support them because I don't want all, this, uh, all the kidnapper people to take over our land from us. That's why I came here to come and support them. And now, as the man of God accurately prophesied, Chief Sunday Igbo not only spoke against the incessant and mundane killings, and kidnapping of his kingsmen, but also physically led an expedition of a search and capture of the notorious sect responsible for these inhuman acts. As though this prophecy hitting the bull's eye was not enough, he shocked the world by saying these traditional heroes will be heavily fortified with charms and idols. But our God will still be the one controlling all their actions from the throne of grace. <laughs> <laughs>